everybody rambling mike here gonna share with you another fun modified deck it's the whimsical tarot if you're interested in any of these decks uh, either for you or for a friend all that information is down below on how to contact me in the description area shoot me a text and i'll send you back an invoice as soon as that invoice is paid i put these things in the mail if this video is running uh, these are already wrapped on the shelf, waiting to go out the door. The Whimsical Tarot, a fun uh, tarot deck right here. It's by Mary Hansen Roberts, illustrated and created by Dorothy Morrison. This is produced by U.S. Games, and it comes with this amazing box. It has old Puss in Boots on the back, and lots and lots of uh, fairy tale uh uh, characters in this deck right here comes with a a cover card which I sign I always sign uh, my decks I signed back here in the back with Puss in Boots because I like him um, and you know because I trim them I hand trim all these by myself this uh, comes with a little white book it's a it's a fairly good little white book it's all in it's all in english has nice descriptions of every card could be a little more extensive but it is what it is and so i'm going to go through the um 78 cards with you right here real quick a quick walk through uh, you know a lot of people want to know what these look like um because you can see with this cover card right here that this deck already has an amazing border on it, part of the artwork, and then they put that old white border around it. I don't know. It doesn't really work for me. Here's what the backs look like. Came out nice with the trimming. Gorgeous, because it had that white border on the back as well. So here we go. We're going to go through all 78 of them. First card is the Fool card. You know, there's the old scarecrow right there, and a little Toto, and he's chasing the old butterfly. Looks like he's gonna step off the cliff, and there's fire down below there. The fool card. The magician is old Puss in Boots. Now, I don't know all these characters. Um, in the comments, if you know who they are, go ahead and leave it in the comment if you would like. The magician. Ah, the High Priestess. I'm not sure who this is. Oh, it could be the Fairy Godmother, huh? The High Priestess, Fairy Godmother. Uh, the Empress is the woman that lived in the shoe. It's a fun deck. Uh, I've got my, got my lovers right here. Looks to me like it's Beauty and the Beast. I got the Hierophant. This looks like uh, Friar Tuck from Robin Hood. I love this uh, Emperor. Uh oh, the Emperor is number four and uh, Hierophant's number five. But this is Santa Claus as the Emperor. Nice Emperor, huh? Comes bearing gifts. Number seven, the Chariot. Cinderella's pumpkin and the mice. Strength card is Little Bo Peep. The Hermit. I'm not. I'm not sure who this is. Merlin, you tell me. The Wheel of Fortune. Justice. <laughs> I like it. It's the three little bears, and he, the baby bear called uh, called the policeman because Goldilocks is uh, stealing his bed, stealing his porridge, all that. Broke his chair, the whole story right there. We got the hangman or the hanged woman. Um, I don't know who this is. You tell me. Looks like she has some seashells in her hand. It's been a long time since I was a child. The Death card, definitely Sleeping Beauty. Uh, Temperance looks like Jack and Jill. Fun deck. The Devil, yeah, just the old devil with the puppet strings. 
the tower. Oh, it's fun. What a fun deck. Uh, the three little pigs and the huffing and the puffing of the big bad wolf. Fun, huh? The star card definitely just looks like a nice, wonderful fairy godmother angelic being. The moon card. Oh, look at this. Hey, diddle diddle, the cat and the fiddle, the cow jumped over the moon. The sun card definitely looks like, um, Tinkerbell. Uh, Judgment, definitely Jiminy Cricket, Whispering in the Ear. And the World card, I'm not sure. Who do you think this is? The World. Fun. All these characters in this amazing deck. The Ace of Wands. Starts off nice. The Two. And they, they call them rods in this. I, I stick with what I'm familiar with. I'm going to call them the wands. The two of wands. It has the old lion trap there with the little mouse coming to help him. The three of wands. Well, it just looks like um, a busy little community right there. The four of wands. I love it. The castle. And see how they have this beautiful border around them already. I mean, it's just a it's just a lovely deck. It's absolutely amazing. And then they put that old white border around. It, it distracts totally from this amazing deck. We got five of wands. Oh, who is this rabbit right here? Somebody tell me, please. Six of wands is definitely our... Um, Dorothy. Seven of Wands. Definitely looks like Jack and the Beanstalk. Eight of Wands. I don't know. You tell me. Nine of Wands. Oh, little boy blue. Oh. Uh, uh, little bugle boy. Was he? Little boy blue, huh? Ten of Wands, I don't know, but she's awful sad right there, been carrying a heavy burden around. Our Page of, of Wands, that's about uh, messages coming in, Triumph. Oh yes, the Knight of Wands, uh, Jack Be Nimble. Fun deck. Our queen and our king of wands. They always look like a matching pair in this amazing deck. Off to the swords, the ace of swords. The two of swords. This is definitely Hansel and Gretel. May have been them in the, boar, in, in the boat earlier. The three of swords. Yeah, definitely the story of Hansel and Gretel. The Four of Swords, oh yes, the Princess and the Pea. They're all in here. Five of Five of Swords, um, the Pied Piper. Six of Swords, I don't know, can you tell me? Seven of Swords. What a fun deck. Well, he's definitely being sneaky, whoever he is. He's getting a couple of those uh, fresh baked pies in the window. Eight of Swords. Oh, that's old Rumpelstiltskin right there. Nine of Swords. Oh, this is Rapunzel, huh? When she cut her hair off. Ten of Swords. Look at that Humpty Dumpty fell off the wall. Our page of swords, our little spy, it's got a little telescope on it. Our knight of swords, <laughs> I don't know who this little fox is, but he definitely has a plan. And our queen and king of swords, that's definitely a little red riding hood. And the woodsman that, you know, saved her from the wolf. Here we go, the ace of cups. The Two of Cups, I'm not sure who they are. 
Somebody tell me. Three of Cups, you know, uh, the Butcher, the Baker, the Candlestick Maker, three men in a tub. Four of Cups. Oh, it's the Emperor in the Emperor's clothes. Fun deck. Five of Cups. Well, that's definitely, you know, Captain Hook. Six of Cups. I don't know, but they definitely enjoy each other's company and have known each other for a very long time, even though they're children. Seven of Cups. Yeah. Many paths to choose from. Eight of Cups. Looks like little, um, uh, little Miss Muppet. Nine of Cups. There's our genie. The wish fulfillment. Ten of Cups. Well, it's just the happy ever after story right there. Our Page of Cups, huh? The Pearl of Great Prize. Knight of Cups. Just the classic lover coming in. And our Queen and King of Cups. Last but not least, the Pinnacles. The Ace of Pinnacles. And as you can see, every suit has a different color. The Two of Pinnacles. The Three of Pinnacles. Uh, it's a story of uh, the spinning wheel. Isn't that Rumpelstiltskin where it makes the bars of gold and had to, something about the first born child or something. Four of Pinnacles. The Five of Pinnacles, the Ugly Duckling. That really wasn't the Ugly Duckling, huh? Six of Pinnacles. I'm not sure, you tell me. Seven of Pinnacles. Definitely tending her garden. Eight of Pinnacles. Nine of Pinnacles, the little le leprechaun at the end of the rainbow in the pot of gold. I mean, the borders are really nice, the ones that they put in with the artwork, all the coins and all the pinnacles, all the wands. It's really nice. The Ten of Pinnacles, the quintessential universal dream. Here's our page of Pinnacles, the studious one. Our Knight of Pinnacles, he's not going to get real fast uh, on that little mouse. It may take him a while. And our King and Queen of Pinnacles looks like Robin Hood and Maid Marian, huh? On that her name. Fun deck. Shuffles nice, fits nicely into the hand. You know, um, it does say... In the book right here that uh, a deck for children and the young at heart. You know, it's a fun deck. It shuffles nicely, fits nice in the hand. Everything trimmed out beautifully on it. It shuffles up real nice. All, my, all mine are machined and rounded corners. And I like these little festive ones myself. They're fun. Very light. Shuffles nicely. What do we got here? The King of Wands wanted to say hi. You're the one that gets up and goes and makes things happen. Like I said, if you want me to wrap one of these up for you or wrap them up for one of your very special friends for a gift and all of that, Send me a text down below. Hope you're enjoying these. Namaste, my friends. Love and light. Talk to you soon. Bye for now.